Hello, my anorexic dolphins. King Cow! It is I, the X. Hello, my friends. What is happening? My name is Ripper X. Well, we are taking a look today, a first look, a first impressions at World of Warplanes. Now, World of Warplanes is uh, developed and created by Wargaming.net. If you ever played World of Tanks, well, those are the same guys that made World of Warplanes. Now, I will say something brief, uh, kind of cool, kind of exciting. I don't believe this is happening just yet, but uh, last year, E3, uh, the big boss of Wargaming.net mentioned that someday World of Tanks, World of, War, uh, World of Warplanes, and World of Battleships uh, will be synced together into one massive game. So essentially, I could be going into this game right now, getting into my plane, shooting at a tank on the ground. That tank will be some player in World of Tanks. Um, etc. etc. I think it's a great idea. It sounds like a very big undertaking, but that said, each game essentially has been written for this, so they have a major plan. I believe this is going to be happening in the next year or two. Now, I could be wrong on that, but at least they were talking about that. I think it is a cool... I think it's pretty awesome, yeah, integrating three games into one, per se. Uh, that said, let's play one game at a time. Let's check out World of Warplanes. This is my very first impressions. I haven't touched the game, so we're going to mess around. We're going to see what this is all about. I kind of want to shoot some people down. I think this is probably a good game to do that. So uh, let's get started. Here we go. Looks like we have a couple airplanes on the bottom of the list we can pick from. Obviously, uh, you can purchase aircraft down the road here. I think uh, as you level up and progress, you can probably uh, maybe unlock some aircraft as well. It looks like we have the bow. Boeing P-12 I fighter, U.S. Army Air Corps, and U.S. Navy uh, biplane fighter on the interwar period. Hit points 45, flower, flower power, flower power 54. Hit points 45 and flower power 54. That's something I'm very interested in. Airspeed, probably important as well, 174. I think the top three are going to be important in terms of choosing which airplane to pick. Okay, 50 hit points, 40 firepower, 160 airspeed. Let's just go ahead and do the P-12. Now, we have channels, we have contacts. I'm just kind of, I'm a noob here. I'm just trying to take a look at this menu system. We have hangar, uh, tech tree. Whoa, okay. So it looks like um, down the road, it looks like you get points, and then you can probably unlock some more of these airplanes. That's pretty sweet. Wow, there's a fighter jet? you got to be kidding me. I didn't, I, I didn't even know that's possible. I thought we were just old school airplanes. Maybe I'm wrong here. 620 hit points, 850 firepower, 654 speed. Okay, maneuverability isn't that good, but you don't really need that much maneuverability when you um, are a boss, okay? That's just insane. A lot of firepower, a lot of hit points. F7U, I'm going to go for that. One day, when I have enough money, it's probably going to take a while. Wow! We even have more options. Check this out. We can do USSR. Wow, it goes all the way to the IO-40. Germany! Wow! Wow. Very cool stuff. Let's see the bottom here. Uh, the Messerschmitt. Uh, P110. Oh my goodness. Take a look at those. that firepower. 1,700 firepower? Are you kidding me? Japan. Let's check this out. Okay, not a, not a lot, but they do have some, some cool stuff here. Oh, we do have achievements as well. Okay. Okay, currently in the closed beta, we have 230 players online, 9 in queue. My name is Ripper X. We are about to get started. Here we go. Ooh, do I click this? What do I do? Uh, battle. Probably want to click battle. It's probably a good thing. So We have standard battle. Uh, standard battle against random players. Single battle. Individual training against bots. Look, we can do training, but my name is Ripper X. I don't mess around. I just go into games and own it up. Okay, this is obviously important here. Pitch down, pitch up, roll left, roll right, AW, oh boy, oh boy, there's a lot to learn here. Wow. Oh, we do have some shortcuts. Oh, chat shortcuts, and then chat mode. Okay, I don't care, I want battle mode. What do we have here? Okay, up, down, left, right, select start. Up, down, left, right, AB, select start is the, the code to get Game Genie on. Okay, so there's a couple ways to control this thing. I could use the mouse, as you can see, uh, in the middle of the screen, this little uh, round circle. That is my mouse. Everywhere I go with that mouse, that's kind of where it's, uh, you know, essentially going to go. Um, and then there's also WASD. Let me just tr try that real quick, see what happens. Okay, W is my, like, my gas pedal. Wow, okay. Okay, obviously W is acceleration, and S is going to be de-acceleration. Looks like it's going to be a combination of my mouse and my keyboard here for this for this flight to take place. There are some enemies right ahead. They're usually in the red square. Okay, 
Okay, why why are you shooting at me? I didn't ask you to shoot me. That our team has six percent on the very top of the screen. It looks like we're doing pretty good here. So, oh. Guys, well, like I said before, uh, very first time playing, the guys do obviously don't know that, and they're playing super hard on me. They're not even giving me a chance to play. Uh, that said, I didn't really know what I was doing, but it was a good first run. My dog is freaking out in the backyard here. It's true. Ouch! Wow! What, what just happened there? Did we win? Oh, victory! You also have to take into account, guys, that uh, when you first start off in the game, you're just going to be using the basic airplanes. Uh, looks like some of the airplanes that you fight against are probably going to be a little bit better. They're going to be upgraded, they have better weapons, better maneuverability. But I, again, I, hey, I started uh, at zero gold, I now have 50 gold, I have 16 free experience, and I have some credits. Okay, well, this is where things start to get complicated. You not only purchase aircraft, but you're going to be able to purchase engine, rear guns, auto cannons. Um, there's a lot of parts. Basically, every part on the airplane you're able to customize and put together. Well, let's try again, well, guys. Round two. Let's here we go. I'm going to try again here. I'm going to this time. I'm going to go ahead and do uh, the P12, and I am not going to suck this time. I'm going to do my best to uh, show you guys how good of a player I am at uh, well airplane games. If I had a joystick, I actually might do a little bit better. I used to have a joystick back in the days uh, of X-Wing. Again, W is going to be my acceleration. I'm using my uh, my mouse to essentially move the aircraft around. Up or down. Uh, w and, or excuse me, A and D will also uh, help my... Uh, kind of help my uh, my aircraft strap left to right. As you can see, the tail uh, gate at the very end is, is... The very back of my aircraft is helping me do that. Can I... Uh oh, keep on keep on the lookout for enemy aircraft. It looks like we, we have a couple right in front of us. Here we go, guys. you do die, there is spectator mode. I can use my, my right mouse button to switch between allied aircraft. The game is very smooth so far. I've seen a couple different landscapes. This is actually pretty cool. Uh oh, something happened here. What just happened? Oh, oh, enemy down. All right. Well, that's good for our team, at least. You know, on a good note, even if I drag my team down, I still get a little bit of experience points. So the more that you, you know, the more that you play, you actually get some points you can uh, use to upgrade your aircraft down the road. You know, I am playing with a, with a noob aircraft. And I'm a noob character, so it goes hand in hand. I gotta say, Yak is doing pretty amazing, though. Yak 91117 is just doing uh, delightful. Uh, granted, his HP is at 34%. He could be getting pretty low here. Whoa, whoa, what'd you, what'd you do that for? Okay. Knock on wood. Wow, so I actually damaged an ally. I got minus... Wow. Minus 78 experience. I don't remember hitting an ally, but I do apologize for that. I'm really sorry. I didn't mean that. There's a consequence for shooting your teammates. My bad. Sorry about that. Let's, uh, let's try this one more time. Third time's a charm, guys. So I lost two, uh, two rounds in a row. I was the first one to go. I did so bad last round, I even attacked one of my own teammates on accident, and I got minus experience for that. So this is where the tides turn. This is where Reparex impresses you. I'm just kidding. I'm probably going to get owned again, but you know what? I'm going to do my best. I seriously am going to do my best. I do enjoy this greatly. I cannot wait to maybe get some new aircraft and maybe see some higher tier battles. Again, this is the lower tier battles, but at least 
you know, you have to start this way anyway, so... Whoa. I must say, this aircraft is a lot more maneuverable. That said, my, uh, well, my firepower isn't that good, but at least I can dodge and get out of incoming attacks. to me, like, besides actual players, there are uh, other op opportunities here to, to get points and help your team out. We have convoys, we have different radar stations that uh, are going to be needed to be, whoa, taken out, exploded. Oh, warning low altitude. Oh, oh, oh it's so close. Oh, I'm getting shot at. I'm getting shot at. just happened guys I thought I was doing really good and it looks like I just got owned uh, that said my teammates hopefully will well help me out here it doesn't look too good it looks like it's four on one hey slowly but surely guys you know the best way to do this is well keep playing get your butt kicked a little bit uh, you get better um, as a player and you also get more points to put into uh, a future airplane or two and you can uh, obviously upgrade your airplane parts upgrade your weapons upgrade your engine Every little part of your, your airplane, you can eventually upgrade it, so uh, you can kick other people's butts like you just saw happen to me. All right, my friends. Well, hey, thank you so much for tuning in. My name is Ripper X. That was my very first impressions of World of Warplates. I got my butt kicked. Uh, hands down, I got my butt kicked. I got owned. Um, I'm just going to tell you guys, uh, don't share that with anyone else. That's between you and me. Uh, I, I guarantee you, next time I play, and it, there's going to be a next time, and there's going to be a second impressions, I will not be getting my butt kicked. I will be owning it up. Uh, that said, I think I need to, again, improve my aircraft. I need to play a little bit more, but I also need to maybe upgrade some of my weapons. Uh, you know, engine upgrades are nice, but I think weapon upgrades grades are going to be even nicer. Uh, again, thank you so much for tuning in. Details uh, below in this description of the video if you want to download the game and sign up for the beta, as well as more information here at MMORPG.com. Thank you so much for tuning in. See you guys next week.